Yo, what's up guys? It's x -Race. Welcome to a new episode of my Elite Face-Off series. It's a series where we compare two Elite versions for any given weapon and find out which one is better and compare the stats. Today we're going to be covering the HBR Insanity and the HBR Barefist, the two Elite versions of the HBR. We're going to compare stats and find out which one is better or maybe which one is just better suited for you. Now before we can actually do that, we need to learn a little bit more about the regular HBR, so let's go ahead and jump straight into its stats. As always, if you do enjoy the video guys, make sure to slap a like and a favorite on the video. It does get this series out there, helps my channel grow, and of course, if you guys are new and you enjoy these elite face-offs, you enjoy weapon comparisons, and a whole bunch of content, then make sure to subscribe so you guys don't miss any videos. But anyways, let's jump straight into the stats, starting off with the HBR Base Edition. Now the HBR Base Edition has a magazine size of 30 rounds, it does damage of 40 up close, 33 at its medium range and it tapers off to 24 at its maximum distance. This makes it a 3 to 5 shot to kill weapon. The HBR has an average rate of fire of 625 rounds per minute with the first four shooting at 857 rounds per minute. The HBR also has low to medium recoil depending on how you feel about recoil patterns pretty easy to manage. So now that we know a little bit about the HBR, let's go ahead and compare it to the other HBRs and find out what exactly do those stat changes mean. So let's go ahead and start with the HBR Insanity. Looking at the player card, we see that it says that it has one extra damage, it has two extra fire rate, and it also has one less handling, which doesn't really do anything. But what does that actually translate to stat-wise? So let's go ahead and jump into it. The HBR Insanity actually has a change in the damage, just like we learned from the actual player card. It does 4 40 damage up close and does 33 at its medium range but the big thing here is that the minimum damage actually gets buffed up instead of it being 24 it is 25 and while that doesn't seem like a lot this actually means that the HBR insanity instead of it being a 3 to 5 shot to kill it's actually a 3 to 4 shot to kill damage now the next thing is that it does have plus 2 fire rate an insane combination the HBR, instead of it having a 625 round per minute average, it has it at 750, 125 rounds faster per minute than the base edition. And those first four shots are going to shoot at 1000 rounds per minute, about as fast as the MP11. That is insane. Now, the two drawbacks of it, which are very, very minimum, are the hip spread, which is going to be a little bit wider, which you won't even notice. And also, one drawback is the fact you cannot have any optic on the HBR Insanity. So, that is the HBR Insanity. But, with that said, let's go ahead and move over to the lesser known version of the HBR Elite. And let's learn a little bit more about it. The HBR Bare Fist. Looking at the player card, we can see that it has one less accuracy, it has one less range, and it also has plus two handling. Which seems like a lot of negatives. So, let's find out about these stats. What do these negatives and positives do to the stats? Let's jump straight into it. The HBR Bare Fist has the exact same damage profile as the base edition 40 33 and 24 it's also a three to five shot kill weapon and it also has the same rate of fire 625 rounds per minute average with the first four being 857 rounds the one upside that we get from this though guys is that the hip spread is going to be a little bit tighter again it's very very minimum you won't even notice it so really it's almost like it's not even a positive it does have, on the other hand, an attachment being the red dot sight. Again, another bad thing about this is that the HBR has less range than either one of the Insanity or the Base Edition. That sucks, and then on top of that, it also has a little bit more recoil than the regular version of the HBR. So, honestly, it has a lot of downsides, doesn't really have a positive. The only positive being that it has a red dot sight attachment. So anyways guys, that was a quick comparison between the two HBR Elite versions. And honestly, if you look at these stats, the HBR Insanity is a way better weapon to use. If you can't use optics on it and you don't like the red dot sight, then either way it's better to have the HBR Insanity. It does more damage, it has a higher rate of fire, and overall it completely poops on the HBR Bare Fist. But anyways guys, thank you so much for watching the video. Let me know in the comment section below. Let me know if you have tried either one of these, which one you feel is a better weapon statistically or just from your experience using it if you don't have it which one of these two would you rather have leave it in the comment section down below thank you guys so much for watching this episode of elite face off if you enjoyed it make sure to slap a like and a favorite on the video it does get the content out there and it does help out my channel a ton guys and of course if you guys are new and you enjoy videos like these elite face offs weapon comparisons 
live commentaries, just a whole bunch of content, guys. And make sure to subscribe so you guys don't miss any videos in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave in the comments what elite should I compare next? What weapon should I do? And thank you guys so much for watching and enjoying this series. I'll see you guys next time. Like, comment, subscribe, and make sure I'm out. Peace.